Hi there, I'm going to help you reading the notes today. So when you come across something like this, notes written here, notes written here, it's like a kind of different language, isn't it? And we have to be able to kind of take that apart to be able to read it, just like we do with words and sentences. So we're going to talk about the pitches first. Now you can see they're on they're on different places. Yeah, kind of here, here, here. Now I'm going to uh, I'm going to talk about. the spaces on our stave first. So you can see the spaces have got F-A-C-E, which spells face. And this is really useful so that we can remember where the A is. And that's our A string, isn't it? And also the E string, where the E string is. Now, um, so you could draw this out and you can do your little circles F, a C E and I often write that on a piece of paper or a little stave next to the piece of music that I'm working on and that helps me if I get stuck to find myself yeah now here we go so I've got the A and I found the E but we also we've got four strings haven't we so we've got the D string and the G string as well so we're not going to worry about the G string at the moment but we're going to worry about the D string. Now, can you see they're kind of equal amounts? Now, what's special about this is it's sitting right underneath it. Now, our D is for dragon, so I think about this one as a dragon who uh, lives underground in the cellar. Yeah, it's underneath the house. Does that make sense? Yeah, underneath the house. Okay, so we've got the E, the open E string, the A, and the D string. That's useful. Okay, so you could probably just, um, you could have a go now, if you grab your violin, pause the video first. I'm going to point to the string, and I want you to just play them. Okay, so get your violin and then pause it. As I point to them, you can play one note on your violin. Yeah, so here, here. Go back to here and here. Can you keep up with me? Great. Okay, so you're getting used to spotting where the E is on the top space. And then the A, where we had to count up, didn't we? F. A to find it in the second space, and then the D, which is right underneath, okay? So don't get mixed up with putting the D here. It's underneath the stave. It's not in the stave. It's beneath it. Okay, so our next challenge is to then find out how we, where the fingers would go. So we've got our, our fingers now written in. So we've got a uh, one, now you'll notice that it's on the line. A uh, one, two is in the space, three is on the line. E, do, 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 do. It's like some steps. Space, line, space, line, space, line, space, line, space. A uh, one, two, three, E, three, two, one, A. Uh, Okay, can you play that now? Okay, so here we go. A, one, two, three, E, three, two, one, A. Very good. Okay, so that's the A string notes. Now, I'm going to just do one um, on uh, below, which hasn't got the notes written on, and you might want to uh, make your own one of these. Okay, so I'm going to write in the A and the E, but I'm not going to write in the ones and the twos. And that's going to encourage us to start seeing whether it's on the space 
are on the line. Okay, can you see what I've done? Yeah, A1, A1, 2, 3, E, 3, 2, 1, A. Do you want to try playing it? So you can pause the video and then when you're ready, you can play it. Ready, steady, go. A, one, two, three, E, three, two, one, A. Very good. Now, I'm going to move swiftly on. So this is a kind of whistle-stop tour. But I'm going to do the D string now. If I can find my D string notes, here they are. And just like we had before, we've got D, one, two, three, and you see that same space, line, space, line, space, when we're doing our little scale. D, one, two, three, A, three, two, one, D. Do you want to try it with me? To pause the video while you're getting yourself ready. Okay, so this is a good thing for to have a helper, a parent to help you. Pause the video. Ready, steady, Go. D, one, two, three, A, three, two, one, D. You think you can do that without the notes written on like we did with the A string? Remember that the dragon lives underneath. And then I'm only writing in the D. The, and the A to encourage us to read it. Yeah, can you see it? Okay. D, one, two, three on the D string, A, back to three on the D string, two, one, A. Got it? Okay. Sorry, at one D, finishing on D. Okay, so I'll count you in. You can get your violins ready. Steady, go. D, one, two, three, A, back to three on the D, two, one, D. Okay, I'm going to make it a little bit more complicated by not going all the way up and down. I'm going to mix it up. So can you play me D, one, two, one, two, three, Two, one, two, D, one, three, two, one, A. Did you keep up? Okay, now what string haven't we done? Well, we haven't done the G string, but we said we were going to leave that one. So let's do the E string. E is on the top, isn't it? F, A, C, E. Let's find the E is on the top space. E, one, two, now I've run out, so I have to put this another little line called a ledger line, so I can go to the three, that's a kind of special one, isn't it? Okay, can you play me that? E, one, two, three, okay, let's do our one below that isn't written, so we can have a go at seeing if we can remember where the notes, where the fingers and the notes go. Remember the one with the extra little ledger line? That was the three on the E string, wasn't it? E, one, two, three, two, one, E. Okay, I'm going to do that again. E, do, 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 do. See, I didn't say them that time. See if you can do it. E, do, 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 do. Okay, we've done loads of that. So we've done loads of the pitch, the going up and down. Now, what about the rhythms? Well, we haven't done much rhythm, so let's do a bit of rhythm. So rhythm is, yeah, that kind of thing. Okay, now we've got 
three different types of rhythms we're going to learn first of all. First one is a crotchet, which is one beat. Yeah, these are all crotchets. One, 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 a whole beat. That's why I've done a circle. Yeah, so think about a whole pizza. Then I've got, um, I'm going to break that beat into two halves. My head's still doing crotchets, whole beats. But my hands are doing quavers, quaver, 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 quaver. So those two halves fit into a whole, don't they? Yeah. Now, I'm going to move swiftly onto the minim. Now, if you put two crotchets together, you join them together, each one of them is one beat. So that'll be one, two, makes two yeah okay two beats now this is a long note Duh. can you see here the sound lasted for two beats Duh. okay now what does it look like well it's not colored in Duh. lasted for two beats so we've done crotchets do 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 quavers. Do 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 do. Now, the tricky thing is to now add these the pitch and the rhythm together. So I've I've done a little uh, example for you to have a go at. I'm going to do some more in another video, so you can try some more, but. Here's one to look at. This was the one I showed you at the beginning. So this is, uh, let's see if we can decipher what this is. So this is a, mm, this is a, a underneath the stave, isn't it? So that must be the D, the dragon, yeah? Do, 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 do. Now, these are crotchets. Do, and then quavers, do, do, crotchet. Do, do. Now, what's this note? Hmm. So this note is, let's, let's work out with the face, F, A, C, E, A. Okay, this is A. Yeah, now we've got four quavers, quaver, quaver. Do, 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 do. Where does it go now? It goes to, back down to the D, but look, it's not coloured in, so it's a minim. Do. All together, it sounds like this. Do, 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 do. Let's see what the next line looks like. So we've got F, A, C, E. Oh, this is an E. E, do, do, A, do, do, G, D, A. Did you spot any of those? So it had, had some E's. Do, do, do. And then it went back down to F, A, A, do, do, do. And then down to our D, D, D. Finishing on our A again. Do. And notice that it was all open strings, wasn't it? So you could have a go at playing that one. Okay. Now I'm going to do it slowly and you can try playing along with me. One, two, ready, go. Do, 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 so that's the end of my note reading video and I'll do some more examples with some fingers in next time, okay? So hope that's helpful.